Hey yo, welcome back everyone to Uncle Kari's The Man, The Myth, The Fisherman. And today we're gonna start this episode off how we usually do, I think. I don't know, we kind of start them off most of the time opening up some soul crates. Ten of them. I fished ten of them before the episode started. I, don't, I was thinking about doing a montage, but we'll see. We'll see how it turns out. Because I don't know how many bosses we're gonna be able to fight. We are officially in post Moon Lord. And uh, I, got, I think I came up with a new strategy here. And that new strategy... Oh, we need you. It's good he came by. We needed him. I think the new strategy is going to be... If we have a bunch of crate stuff. You know, stuff that allows us to fish just crates. I bet we could get soul crates like it's nothing. I bet we can get like a million soul crates. We just got one right there. I mean, they're not that hard to get. But they ain't that easy to get at the same time. So, that's why I want to try out this strategy. We do need some more fragments though. I hope we can make some fractalite bars. But we're about to see... We are about to see in a second. But yeah, like I said, no clue. No clue at all if we're going to be able to take on the Overseer. But we're going to see. I talked a lot. Let me take a deep breath. <gasps> Alright, I'm ready now. I'm sorry if that disturbed you or turned you on or whatever. Uh, let's sell this. Because I have like a million of those. And more soul crates. Who doesn't love opening up a soul crate? So can I make fractalite bars now? Ye or knee? I don't think I can. I'm probably missing something. Uh, oh, yeah. We kind of need to make the amalgam. That would make sense. And also, the bars themselves. It's probably... Oh, damn. We made four. Uh, the luminite itself. I hope there's nothing I have to craft. Like, use the luminite on. Because we're about to use it on fractalite. It's five per, per piece. Oh, my God. That's so expensive. How many we can make? Four? That's not bad. That's already like a really good start. I don't think it's going to be that grindy, but at the same time, it's going to be decently grindy. I don't think it's going to be... What's that armor in uh, Calamity? I don't think it's going to be as grindy as that one armor set in Calamity. But it's going to be pretty grindy at the same time. I think our goal should be to upgrade... Oh, shit. I have no idea. <laughs> 64 Illuminite. Oh, my God. I guess it, that's how much it costs to make all, make all that. Oh, man. <laughs> I think it's going to be easier this way. I don't know. Not 100% on that. Eight. So we need eight. Oh, my God. And then we got to make all the rod, separate rods, too. Jeez. This. Okay. It's going to be pretty grindy. <laughs> I think we should start start with accessories. We'll start small. And slowly work our way up. Disable any incoming house of projectile. That's not bad. Up to 50% of all damage receivers deducted from men instead. That's really, really good. But I think we should start with this one or this one. Increase barber damage for 12% each second. Will cost him for a man per second. Maximum 300 G's. Okay. Yeah. I like that. We'll do that one. What is it called? Fractalite? Now maximum mana escalation reel. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Do it. Maximum. Boom. Let's go. We just need to get warding on that. Trying to think. We do need to do some upgrades here. But I am waiting for a live stream. I haven't been able to live stream at all. I've just been kind of tired. Because my work schedule is about to change to the work schedule where I can live stream and upload a lot more. But it hasn't yet. So I'm like, I didn't have the time to do anything. And also, one of my friends, one out of two, who uh, recently joined the Air Force, they came over to visit for uh, two weeks. And I didn't really hang out with him the first week because he was hanging out with his family. But then he came through with the boys and hung out with us. So I've been busy the last like three days hanging out with him. So uh, I have a good reason. Expect like the beginning of December because that's when my other friend comes through. It's also December. Uh, I like to upload that in December. But yeah. Be ready. I don't know why I said that. More streams coming up. I was supposed to stream today. But obviously like I just said. I went out with my friend. Because he's going to be gone for a year. And then he's going to visit again. And then he's going to be gone for four years. It's like, god damn. That always sucks when, you know, people close to you go into, like, the military and stuff like that. We're going to find another Moon Lord. Because I need the stuff. But why would we do that in the background? Ooh, I went to the wrong place. A lot of people have been telling me, like, I should change Middle Mouse. Because, or I should change my keybind so Middle Mouse puts this directly into the recipe browser. But the thing is, I use Cheat Sheet, which is a, it's made by the same creator as Recipe Browser, but it ain't the same. I think, 
it's made by the same creator but uh don't worry about it i've been using cheat sheet for like two almost three years now i think it's gonna be three years next month don't worry about it i'm good i know i know i know clicking a couple extra times is sounds like an impossible task to some of you don't worry i'm about to die I took a lot of damage right there. Jeez, man. He wasn't playing around at the beginning. Uh oh, okay. I need to get the ninja toby. That's something I really need to get this episode. Pretty much, we're just going to be doing upgrades. I don't know if we'll take on an actual boss. Like, I could attempt a boss, but I don't have a lot of faith. Faith. A lot of faith in us beating the boss. I'm going to get shot by this. I thought he was going to start on the left side. But... I just picked up a Super Mario Party today. It's pretty fun. I really like it. Mainly because it has like all the features of the last game. Last two games, which they weren't really great features. I don't know why I'm excited about that. But also, it, uh, I'm not affected by the life stick. No, stop. Okay. Hold up. This is getting serious. I don't want to talk right now. This is really serious. I need to do this. We are about to die. Oh no, I missed two. There you go. But uh, it has a, it has WarioWare pretty much implemented in it. Not exactly WarioWare, but it pretty much has all the features that WarioWare had. And uh, it's got the last two games, nine and ten, that is in it too. We we are pretty much dead. I don't think we're gonna survive. <laughs> the anti life steal is really fucking us in the ass right now. And also the fact that his eyes are like always fucking closed is not helping either. Come on, bro. I can only fly around for so long. Oh, I'm dead. Wait! No, I'm dead. Wow. <laughs> we got destroyed. It was that like beginning half where we couldn't fucking latch on to anything. Yeah. I don't know what the hell I was talking about. I'm kind of distracted now. Alright, this should be way easier. Because I killed his m middle eye. Okay, this is a big problem, is trying to latch onto him. And then he closes his eye when I get close, you fucker. <laughs> Just do this. It's easier. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, my God. This is so annoying. Come on. I don't remember having this many problems the first fight. <laughs> but we are definitely having some problems latching on. We're good now. It should be good now. I think... The lack of defense and also the lack of life steal is really a big factor in these fights. I, mean, I have warding on like everything, even the wings. And I have like a lot of accessories too, so I should have a decent amount of defense. It's just the armor set is a, a big factor in taking away our defense because we don't have a good armor set. We can have a way better armor set, we just don't. At this moment, we don't. Okay, sell everything else. There you go. Don't need that. Boom, bada, bing. We got more Luminites, even though I think that's the last thing to be worried about right now. So we're going to do some upgrading. And the first thing we're going to attempt to upgrade here is the uh, Ninja Tabi. Let's see what that can work into. So what do I have? I need the Tabi and I need Black Belt. No. Tiger Claws. Can I make Tiger Claws? I can't make Tiger Claws. What the heck? Climbing claws. Climbing boom. So there's that. So make tiger claws. Boom. Am I like missing something? Like where? Is there really no more uh, split bosses? Are they just? There's only like three. I never knew that. I thought those hard post hard mode or post moon lord ones, or just hard mode ones in general. Did we ever fight one in hard mode? I don't think we did. I hope I still have... Yeah, I do have the mods still in here. Okay, hold up. Let me zoom in. Let me do this. So, uh, back to what we were doing. We need the Tabby, which we should be able to make. Tab tabby, 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 whatever. I've heard multiple pronunciations. And now we're making the uh, Ninja Gear. Not the... Whatever I called it earlier. Boom. So, from here, we could either go down the uh, Calamity accessory route... Or we can go for Bass Scroll, which I don't think we can exactly go for. Hmm. Um. 
It's a nearby smoke. And you always crit when you attack a full health enemy. That's only during smoke, standing near smoke. I think this would be the best way to go, only because this upgrades into other stuff. But I don't really think it helps me that much. <laughs> Grand Shadow Flint Powers is pretty much for minions. I think we're good, just as hard Master Ninja Gear, whatever. So let's toss that in there. And also, one other thing we're going to make, which would have been good to get on stream, but we're going to get it during this is the Comet Shard, which is actually not that hard to get. So let's head to spawn. Go ahead and reforge this. We got more than enough gold to reforge this. I mean, we'll attempt a boss fight. I think we're going to take on a... Uh... No, I don't want to. I got Grog next three times. I was going to say take on the Abomination, but we'll, we'll just do that during the live stream because I need to gather all this stuff for it. I really don't know. Maybe Jumbo Kakatar. He might be the easiest to take. Definitely this list is not really based on difficulty sometimes, it's really just, I don't know what it's based on, but uh, we'll see. Warding, let me get that warding, cough it up, I know you want to give me warding, come on, come on, give me warding, come on. <laughs> so uh, recently I finished Forager, and a lot of people like that series, I think the next series we're going to do, until obviously Red Dead and 76 come out, because I'm... My channel is doing a major shift into those games. Whether I'll still have a Terraria, obviously, but we all know Game Raiders is my channel as a Terraria modded channel. It's gonna become a fucking Red Dead and Fallout channel, whether you like it or not. I really like Red Dead. I'm gonna say Red Dead is my favorite game, but I think Red Dead 2 White might be one of my favorite games. Maybe not of all time. Not probably all time, honestly. It looks like it's, it has the potential to be God tier. But, uh, it's, my channel's definitely gonna shift focus to Fallout and Red Dead, with Terraria still sprinkled in. But yeah, until then, I think I might play Swords of Ditto. It's either Swords of Ditto or Starbound, modded Starbound. Now, I feel like you guys are biased and you're gonna choose Starbound if I give you, a, like, a voting option. So, I'm not gonna. It'll probably, I don't know, maybe I'll, we'll see. <laughs> maybe I'll start a series on both of them. And we'll see. Swords of Ditto really good looking game and it looks really fun but if y'all were there during the stream i played it for like five minutes and then that's it and i had fun in those five minutes that i played it, it looked really fun it had like amazing world amazing world of gumball like type art okay i don't know if that's the right art it had some sort of art like that i think it's, it might be amazing world of gumball it felt like adventure time and amazing world of gumball like combined together that's what the art felt like and uh can't wait to play it again. I haven't played it in a while. I've also been meaning to play Starbound eventually, but I just never got around to that. Like a lot of things. And hopefully with my new schedule, I can get around to those things. Hopefully. But uh, I plan, obviously Red Dead comes out, playing that. Fallout comes out, playing that. Fallout, I think will be a stream series. Uh, I think I'm gonna stream both of them, but. And then post the shit to YouTube. We'll see. I gotta learn how to use the I was gonna say HD PVR. I don't think people use those Elgatos. I gotta learn how to use an Elgato because I gotta buy that somewhat soon. Probably like next paycheck, I'll buy it and I'll test it out with some of the games. I probably should have got it like recently, but it's like a hundred bucks, so it's not exactly something you just drop, especially when you buy DX Racer like moi, moi being me. I don't know if the moi actually means me in French. My voice cracked. But uh, we have enough, so we can make this comment sure. We have enough. Open sesame. I don't know what I said. Craft sesame. Boom. Damn, look at that. We got a lot of extra mana. So this thing will come in handy. If it wasn't coming in handy already. But yeah, let's try and take on uh, the Jumbo Kakatar. And hopefully we can do it. I really hope we can. We are about to see. It's not like we don't have a lot of chances to do it. Uh, we need Luscious Cactus, which I think I might have sold. <laughs> I don't remember. Do I have it in my inventory still? Yeah, I don't think I have it anymore. That's fine. Do we have uh, the desert NPC? Wait, he's not in his house anymore. Why not? What the heck? When did he move out? I have no idea when he moved out. Okay, hold on. Let me do something here. Does this guy sell Juice's new boss? I never 
check that because it's not really a boss I fight all the time. Does he sell the cactus stuff? He doesn't. How do you even summon in the cactus boss? I don't remember. <laughs> Wait. I don't I'm confused. I figured it out. Succulent cactus meal. Mmm. Let's fight this boss two times, I guess. Might as well. I don't know if you guys saw me get this mount, but got it during the uh when I was killing all the invasion monsters. What happened here? When when did half this house go missing? Whatever, don't worry about it. I'm kinda worried about it. Let's uh out. Let's do this. And then just like add back to this house. Good enough for now. Not really. I kind of want it like this. Actually, let's add a door. How often do I put doors on things? Doors so the guy has safety. And then I'll also... Dude, I'm pimping this guy's house out. And also, I'll add... Uh, what the hell? I'll add platforms on the rooftop. Just so I can get in easily, too. And then with this last platform, we're going to run all the way down here. There you go. Let's do it. Oh, it has to be underground. Let's do it. Let's do it. Is this not underground enough? Come on, bro. Don't make me go that deep. Okay, we're going to go down all the way to that arena I made down here then. And we'll see. Well, we're not going to see. We're going to destroy this boss. We're going to destroy it so easily. I'm going to use a Terra Battle Rock. How much damage does uh, this one do? 140 is not bad. Give him a damage weapon. Well, not damage. Utility, pretty much. Put this down here. Okay. Bring your alpha cactus ass over here. Wait, this is the wrong rod. Switch rods. Damn! Look at my boy. Look at my boy. He got the moves. Look at that. He does a little side to side during this part of the music. If you guys didn't know, his boss moves to the music. Which is really, really a unique thing. Shout out Juiced. Got, well, I, a lot of Terraria bosses are unique. But also, a lot of them are not unique at all. You get what I'm saying? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna drop any names, Tremor. Uh, but a lot of bosses can do some work to be unique. But it's fine. As long as the sprite is cool. It's kind of let down, though. If the sprite is really cool and then the boss fight isn't, it's like, it's kind of let down. So, uh,. Never mind, I'll take my statement back though, I was about to say. I was about to say, the sprite is cool, I guess it's alright. It's not. Both, at least be a little unique if the sprite is cool. But, uh, make sure the sprite is cool first. That's, that's definitely, that's definitely how you do it first. So, let's see here. Mustache Cactioid, whatever the fuck it's called. There it is. Boom. I'm ready. I don't remember if we have to fight him underground or not, so I'm not gonna... <laughs> We'll just, uh, we'll see how it goes. I really need to set up teleporters. A live stream is really needed. I got work tomorrow, aka the day you'll be watching this. And I don't think I'll have time to live stream, but... Just no one is coming soon. That's all I gotta say. I didn't mean to buy two of those. Alright. Oh, I was about to teleport. We live right next to the desert. Don't need to. I need, like, a teleporter room? I really need to. There's some things I need to work on in this world, and we're in post Moon Lord, so like I'm a little late. That I have that a lot with <laughs> Terraria series. I'm very uh, slow when it comes to building stuff and finishing certain things. Oops, my bad. Wait, why am I going all the way down here? We're finding them up there. If it don't work, it don't work. It's fine. Perfect. Just where I wanted you to be. Cheeks clap and spread. Okay, we're gonna switch to the other. Uh, no, we're not. Not now, not now. Not, not. As soon as he stops spinning off around us. Alright, switch to the other one. See how it is. Oh, he's doing a lot more damage. He's doing a lot more damage. Look at the dodges. Oh, that was a bad dodge. Oh! He's grabbing. He's doing this shit again. He switched to the lifesteal. Oh, God. I don't like this. <laughs> okay, switch back. Switch back. We have, we have the health to lose. Okay. Not so much anymore. Switch back. It's working. Oh, look at all the boys he's summoned. This is going to get us that cash. This is going to get us that cash flow. We 
you may not have it instantly, but once I open this treasure bag, the cash is here. And I'm ready for it. This is the moment I've been waiting for for a while, because I know we've been having cash bombs throughout like every beginning of the series, so I'm always hyped to get to this point. To, to where cash will not be a problem. Gotcha! I got, that boy got destroyed. Give me all that. Even though, like, recently cash wasn't really a, pop, a problem to us, like, very recently, we were starting to get a bunch of cash. But, it is very nice for it to forever, from this point on, never be a problem again. Boom, bada, bing. 25 platinum. May not sound like a lot. It's a decent bit, okay? Don't laugh. It's a lot. Don't even think about grinning, either. 25 platinum goes a long way. That's like a lot of calamity and reforges. A lot of vanilla and calamity reforges. But yeah, there you go. There's the boss dead. I think to end this episode off, I might just do a fishing montage and try and get as many crates as I can. Because I want to at least upgrade whatever else I can upgrade. Can't, can't I upgrade this too? Maybe I'll upgrade. No. I'll just switch as the tempo or whatever. Uh, this. The fishing knife I might upgrade, maybe. I don't know. Does this upgrade? That doesn't upgrade. Hold up. Let me see what some real quick then. Let me see what else fractalites used in. That I can upgrade right now. Uh we definitely need another wait, do we need another accessory? I think it's because I added this. It's replaceable though. Provides ten percent mana siphon on damage dealt with a bobber. Oof. It's pretty good. <laughs> Provides ten percent lifesteal on damage. Ooh, that's the one we should get. So we need five. Damn, what do I get rid of though? What do I get rid of? The hook set? I don't know. I have no idea. I think for now, we're gonna make that one anyways. We're gonna make that one. Allows for casting 32 extra line. Whoa, what the fuck? Uh, but yeah, we're gonna get this one. So we need five amalgates, five fractalite. So AKA 10 energy amalgates. Oh man, this is, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun. Alright, to end off the episode, we have gathered up everything, I hope. I, th I think it was five. But we have gathered up what I'm assuming to be everything. And we just need one more. Oh no, we're missing one nebula fragment. Okay, hold up. We'll just do this. Oh, we should be good now. So I think the easier way to get the fragments, as you can see, I don't know if you can catch it in the montage, but I was looking at this. Boom. It might be easier to go in a different world, kill Skeletron a bunch of time, and just farm these. 
So I might do that off camera. We'll see. Or the live stream, whenever. We'll see. Why am I like blue? What the heck is going on here? Got all this water like dripping off of me. Okay, I have no idea what that is. But hopefully, we can make this vampire line. Yes, we straight up can just make it sweet. Tumblr loves a middle and his own. Ooh, that's not bad. Um, let's make that. That was like a silent burp. It was more like a hiccup. It's pretty much what a silent burp is. Boom, bada, bing. It has been completed. I think we will replace the uh, fishing knife for now. I, I don't think I'm ever going to use this. If I'm being honest, I don't think I'm going to use that. Actually, that's a lie. I thought it was called guarding. Does it not go by? Uh, it doesn't go by the prefix. I thought it would. Okay, I, honestly, the only thing I probably wouldn't use is this guy. All the other things I'll use. But yeah, I'll probably use a combination of these three accessories when we go down to the abyss to finally slay all the monsters that have been making fun of me because we still haven't done that but yeah let's go ahead let's reforge this and we after this more than likely we won't have to use the uh life force battle rod anymore does it tell us how much life steal it does drains life force from opponent surprising fast i don't it doesn't tell you obviously but I'm gonna just assume that we don't have to use it anymore. Which is a big upgrade. Because I really didn't want to use it anymore. Because <laughs> uh, his damage was a little bit lackluster. Especially getting later and later into the game. But boom. We can move everything. Uh, I think instead of moving everything. Like I was just about to. We're gonna do this instead. Where's the dragon battle rod? I think it's inside of here. Just give me the dragon battle rod. I'll, I'll keep it on me. I really need to min max here. Why do I have rockets in my inventory? What the fuck? Uh, I really need to min max here and get some of those baits that give me buffs and stuff on my hooks. That's something I need to do. Can I get like a damage one, please? Demonic, perfect. Was this one sighted? Damn, it does 800 damage. Jeez. All right, yeah, that should be good. I don't know. We'll make the baits probably. I bet if I just type in bait. Excellent drink potion. I bet if I just type in bait, we can make a bunch. Yeah, we can definitely. Uh, let's go ahead. Put these two away. We're not going to need those. And let's look at the baits. Before we end off, 100% before we end off. How much master bait I got in here? Not a lot. Okay, I lied. We'll look at this in the next episode. I'm going to look up what's the best ones. But I will see y'all next time.